He Diddy, a.k.a. Sean Diddy Combs, is on the run after his homes in both Miami and Los Angeles were raided by Homeland Security weeks after he was accused of sexual misconduct and alleged trafficking. An old video of him and a 15-year-old Justin Bieber has emerged amidst the turmoil, which now appears significantly more troubling given the circumstances. This was the video in question, and I want you guys to pay close attention to what he's saying. Justin, he's in, you ever seen the movie 48 Hours? Right now, he's having 48 Hours with Diddy, him and his boy. Um, they're having the times of their lives, like, like, like the, you know, where we hanging out and what we doing. Um, we, we can't really disclose, but, um, it's definitely a 15 year old's dream. Um, you know, I, I, I have been given custody of him. You know, he yeah. signed the Usher. I'm signed the Usher. I, I, I had legal guardianship of Usher when, when, you know, he, he did his first album. I did yes. Usher's first album. I don't really, I don't have legal guardianship of him, but for the next 48 hours, he's with me. So, um, and yeah, and, um. And yeah, and we're gonna go full, buck full crazy. Going crazy. I mean, you can't just sit there and tell me that this doesn't insinuate he was about to take advantage of Justin Bieber in some inappropriate way, most likely against his will. Again, Justin was 15 at the time. Justin has mentioned his connection with P. Diddy in the past through Usher, who had signed him. And now the mystery surrounding Sean Diddy Combs, better known by P. Diddy, persists as reports suggest that he has fled the country, you guys. Yeah, that's right. During the raids on his residence, Diddy was nowhere to be found at either of his locations, and his current whereabouts are completely unknown. It is now speculated that he has indeed left the U.S. in an attempt to evade authorities. Now, as I mentioned, the feds have raided P. Diddy's homes and have been looking for him due to the ongoing misconduct and investigation being done against him. There have been multiple allegations against the musician, including a suit from his ex-girlfriend Cassie and another one from music producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones. Some fans have even monitored the flight path of what is believed to be P. Diddy's private jet, which recently touched down on the Caribbean island of Antigua. The New York Post reported on this, saying Diddy has seemingly disappeared and so has his jet. Around the same time as a raid on his houses in California in Florida on Monday, the rapper and record company mogul was spotted frantically talking on his phone at Opaloka Airport in Miami. It has since emerged one of Diddy's employees, Brendan Paul, 25, had just been stopped at the airport and arrested on charges by Miami-Dade police. Diddy, also known as Sean Combs, has not been spotted in public since. The rapper's private jet, with a distinctive all-black paint job, has also suspiciously banished from public tracking site FlightAware. So that's pretty interesting, might I add. Now, this video of both P. Diddy and Justin Bieber has been recirculating on social media since the allegations of him had come out, and they've been spreading all over social media, especially over on TikTok and Twitter with users criticizing him and labeling him as creepy. Lots of people are even voicing their worries for Justin Bieber, suggesting that he might have endured distressing experiences as a child star and might explain why some of his fans think that he is traumatized and just looks so sad and depressed most of the time when he's out in public. There's even been anticipation that Justin Bieber is going to get raided next in an attempt to prevent him from speaking out against P. Diddy and his alleged experience with him when he was a minor. Check it out. There is going to be a lot of celebrity takedowns when it comes to the whole P. Diddy situation. A lot of people are saying Jay-Z is next. It seems like Diddy is going to make Justin his scapegoat. I'm sure many of you know Sloan Bella. She basically predicted this whole Diddy takedown investigation. Now Justin has a very weird relationship with Diddy. Something had happened because young Justin Bieber wasn't seen with Diddy for a while after that. Got my number, so. Justin's right, okay. so uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. I'm starting to act different, huh? You, you, ain't, you ain't been calling me and hanging out the way we used to hang out. Well, I mean, you haven't. I mean, you try to get in contact with me, you know, through all my, you know, business, you know, partners and whatnot. Mm -hmm. But you, you never really got my number, so. Right. Okay. My number. Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. Tell you. During Justin's party era in 2015 and 2016, he tried to break out of the celebrity alight blackmailing. TMZ did a whole report on it, then redacted it. This is one of the only articles left up of the TMZ incident. Last year or two years ago, this article is stating that he became more active in a Bible study and allegedly shared a horrific story. The story goes along the lines of he was attending a party with producers, power agents, and a young boy had been brought to the party for the industry elite. And he was encouraged to 
Yeah. Allegedly, Justin said, I didn't want to do this. I really didn't. They said this kid was rugged, explaining that it was made clear to him that he would gain entry to the business side of the industry if he joined the club by passing the initiation right to join the club. I had to do bad things to this poor kid. But then I realized that wasn't enough for them. I'd also have to unalive this little child. You can read the rest. Now Sloan argues that Diddy is going to make Justin the scapegoat next because he's not ready to take down Jay-Z who has a whole group behind him. Instead, this story is going to get pinned on Justin. I pray that it doesn't as it seems Justin was a victim. This is just a prediction from someone else who has predicted correct things about celebrity elites. Trafficking investigation against Diddy is just one of several legal battles the music executive is currently facing. It all started when his ex-girlfriend of 11 years, Cassie, sued him for rape and decades-long physical abuse last year. She called him out for years of depraved conduct, including forcing her into a reliant and sexually abusive lifestyle. Less than 24 hours after she filed the lawsuit, Diddy settled it out of court. However, her suit opened the way for many other victims to accuse the rapper of repeated sexual assault. Diddy is now at the receiving end of lawsuits, including one from music producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones. Jones, who used to work as a producer and videographer for Diddy, accused the business mogul of repeatedly him during the production process for his last album, the love album Off the Grid. According to NBC News, Jones claimed that Diddy used to grow his private part to groom him for sex and other activities. If this is true, this is just so effing gross and disturbing. And I mean, the fact that it's being reported, there's multiple allegations against him. The fact that it's being reported that he is not in his residences, both of them at that during the time of the feds looking for him and raiding his homes. I mean, it just all seems very sketchy and there just has to be something going on behind the scenes and something more dark and sinister into P. Diddy's lifestyle and his life choices that have led up to him being involved in these suits and Homeland Security on the hunt for him. So over on Twitter, here's what many people have to say. This video is so sad, but explains a lot about who Justin is now. Explains Justin in which way? Traumatized. This is just sick. It seems like Justin Bieber has some skeletons he may need to divulge and may explain some of his behaviors. The Biebs look nervous. Who was protecting this young boy? His body language says a lot. Now the public knows why Justin Bieber went a little squirrely in his early 20s. When you know, you know. Victim of PTSD. This clip of P. Diddy, 40, and Justin Bieber, 15, has been going viral along with a clip of Diddy asking a 17-year-old Justin Bieber why he doesn't want to hang out with him anymore. It was hard for me being that young and being in the industry and not knowing where to turn and everyone, you know, telling me they love me and, you know, just turn their back on you in a second. Um, so... Yeah. It's super creepy seeing all these videos of Diddy that's coming out, but what's really concerning is Diddy might be just the tip of the iceberg. How many more Diddies are still protected in the industry? How many more kids have been gr Anyways, you guys, I definitely want to know your take on this whole situation. Definitely let me know your thoughts on everything that is coming out about P. Diddy in the comments down below, and also what you thought of the clip of him and Justin Bieber that is now resurfacing on social media. Let me know your thoughts. I'd love to know. I love you guys so much, and as always, I'll see y'all in the next video.